In this video, I am going to show you how you can change the Flutter mobile application icon. So you see that I am having a very simple application with Flutter logo, which is the default. But in no way my startup idea or my business idea is related to Flutter. The idea is very much different. The app is only built using Flutter. So let me show you the difficult way and which we are not going to do. So you see that you just have to go to these things and you see there are some icons for different devices for the ios you just have to like follow this path and when you follow this path you will find that there are various icons there are not only one icon there are lots of icons so in order to change that we need to replace all of them which is difficult but what i want that i want to set this icon as my business icon or the company icon so how can i do that without like wasting lots of time or without like uh, doing it manually so for that i can use flutter launcher icons so this will do everything automatically first of all i need to go into my pub spec.yml file so there is dependency and dev dependency so in the dev dependency i will add this Okay, once you add this dev dependency, just like do the flutter pub get or just save it, it will automatically do the flutter pub get for you, like in VS Code. Okay, so now I have to add some configuration. So you just have to come at the bottom of your pubspec.yml and you just have to like write the configuration. So before writing the configuration, I am going to add the icon. So let's create a directory called images and inside that i will just copy and paste the logo of my company or the business okay so now i will be start writing the configuration so just write flutter underscore icons so now here i will write the configuration for my icon so the first one is the image path so the image path is you can see images slash app hyphen logo okay so the next thing is i want to create this for android android yep to make it true for ios yep and for the ios there is one more thing which is like a remove alpha ios true yeah so if your image is png you need to remove the alpha okay so that's it we have made the configuration everything is like good at this point i just need to like run one command so you see there is a configuration adding the this thing and there is the command which is flutter pub run flutter launcher icon colon man so i will just copy this thing okay mm, yep just paste it that's it so i will do it quickly it will take some time uh that's it so you see creating default icon for android overwriting the default icon launcher icon which overwriting the ios so you saw that the icon was already exist so it was just replacing the old icon with the new icon so it just replaced it so i will delete the application and after that i will run it again so run without debugging okay so meanwhile i am going to show you something like let's go to android app src and the main uh okay i think i need to run it again uh, yeah uh yep so if you go to the uh, resource you will see that uh, there are like the icons so the icon has been updated automatically can you see yep the icon has been updated automatically for the ios also if you will go and you will check you will find that the icon has been updated automatically so i hope you got the idea how you can create the icon so in my case the icon was not in the shape of a square like one is to one so if it was one is to one then i would have got like little beautiful icon like after building this thing so make sure like whenever you are making a company logo or square uh, company logo or app icon try to make it in shape of a square okay so once the icon has been made you can remove the configuration because you don't need this anymore so let's go to home you see that at the top there is the company icon on the home screen also there is company icon 
so now as i got the things which i was expecting so now i can comment this i can delete this whatever i want because i don't need this anymore i am not going to like run this command again i am not going to change my icon again so that's why you don't need it so thank you see you in the next video